Hi everyone, it's Astrid with Better Believe Fit. I'm so excited. This week we are going to be bringing you workouts, we're going to be bringing you recipes, we're going to be bringing you loads of inspiration. But I wanted to give you a quick chat about the workout that I'm going to post for today. I'm going to have it all typed up for you underneath the post as usual, but I thought it would be fun for you guys to actually meet me and for me to give you a quick description of each move. A lot of times there's questions asked and I'll try to find you a link on face on YouTube or anything. Maybe share a post another fitness page had done on the same workout just to let you know, um, you know how to do it properly. Just always remember when we do these moves we are trying to be safe. We are not trying to kill ourselves. We are trying to get in shape, get healthy, get fit, and be happy doing it. And nobody's happy when they throw out their knee or their back. So let me go ahead and give you the rundown. We're going to be doing a Tabata style workout. When I say Tabata style, I mean 50 seconds work, 10 seconds rest. If you can't manage the 50 seconds, you can adjust your timer. 30 seconds work, 30 seconds rest. You do what you can. Push yourself though. Don't be a baby. Okay, so I have five moves for you. We're going to do 50 seconds on, 10 seconds off. We're going to be doing touchdowns walk out push-ups, plank side jumps, star crunches, and these are my new favorites, one arm press-ups. They're great. They're very deceiving. When I first saw it, I thought, oh, this is not going to be hard at all, but man, let me tell you what, it pushes your arms, your core, everything, and you just go and concentrate on your form when you're doing these moves. So I just want to give a quick shout out to my four fab fitters that we're going to be posting. It's going to be Megan with Go Mommy Go. Go check out her page. And Mimi with Heavenly Healthy. And of course, Carissa with Creating a Family of Lettuce Heads. There will be links to the pages. Go check them out. Like them. And hopefully we'll be getting a bunch of good feedback from you guys. So let me just adjust the camera and let's get it on. First move we're going to be doing is touchdowns. Good move to get your heart rate up, get you warmed up. 50 seconds work, 10 seconds off. Touchdown is basically lateral lunges and we're going to be going quickly from side to side. So when you start off, you're going to lean all the way back. Keep your knee behind your toes. You do not want to hurt yourself. And we want to try to get our leg at a 90 degree, best you can. And you're going to go down and touch and then hop up, down and touch. And just keep hopping and touching down and bending and watching your form. Be careful, keep your core tight, and just try to work through 50 seconds. Okay, next move is going to be walk out, push up, and you walk yourself back up. Concentrate on keeping your core tight, your form good. When you go down, plank position, push up. If you need to modify, go to your knees. If you can only go down to the plank position and walk yourself back up, do that. Our goal is to get you there if you're not already there. So do the best that you can and let's go. So we're going to start here. Hands on the floor. Keep your core tight. You're going to walk all the way down. Straight. Push up. Walk your hand back. There we go. Let's do another one. Down. Walk your hands out. Core tight. Push up. There we go. Plank. Walk out. Plank. Push up. Okay, next move we're doing is back in a plank. We're doing plank side jumps. What you need to do is concentrate keeping your core tight. We're going to get down in plank position and then we are going to jump our legs up and over kind of like in a diagonal. You'll see. <laughs> Okay, so we're in good plank position, and what we're going to do then is jump and back, up and side and back. So each side, you can count as one rep, but since we're doing Tabata, it doesn't really matter. We're not counting reps unless you're trying to keep score and see how much better you do next time. So again, side, back, side, back. Okay, plank side jumps. There you go. We're going to be doing star crunches, a yummy, tasty treat that makes you fat. But 
this is a really great ab workout. It's good for your core. Crunch it up. Let me show you how. All right. You're going to lay back. Keep your core tight. Opposite hand to opposite foot. You're going to crunch up. Touch. Ready? Touch. Down. And if you need to use your elbow for leverage when you're coming up, you can push up and do that. Push up and do that. And if you're not there yet, you can always just do a regular crunch and try to lean up, put your foot up, touch. You can hold on the back of your leg. Touch. Touch. Let's try it. All the way. All the way. Star crunches. It's a good one. Last move. We're going to be doing one arm press ups. Ready? Down onto the floor as if you were going to do a push up. Legs out, feet apart, give yourself some balance. One arm underneath the shoulder, other arm away, out of the way, on your back, on your butt, on the floor, wherever you need it to be. Maybe. Can you work out? And what we're going to do is push up, up onto the knees, keeping your core tight, and then up. And back down, down. Try it again. Push up, using your core. Up, down, down. The key to this is to push your body up, then get up on your knees, and then bend up, and then come back down. You will really feel this in your core. Let's do one more. Push up, two knees, up, back down. Damn. Good job. Thanks for hanging out with me today. Thanks for working out with me today. If you have any questions, comment. I will try to answer back as soon as I can. And remember, for Fab Fitters, go check out the other pages, Heavenly Healthy, Go Mommy Go, and Creating a Family of Lettuce Heads. And we will see you again soon. Bye.